Hi folks, this is Sean McCormick. And in this very short video, we're going to look at how you get your plugins ready so that you can use Luminar from inside Lightroom. So what you do is you come up to the Luminar menu and you click on install plugins. And you have to choose a Lightroom and Photoshop if you have them. So click install. And then obviously you have to put in your password. And you do get a warning here that you need to restart Lightroom for the plugins to work. Click OK. And then click Done. And that's then done. So now I'm going to restart Lightroom. But I'm going to do it off camera as such. So I've restarted Lightroom. I come up to the photo menu and I go edit in. See now Luminar dot 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 has information. So we click on that. And that will now give us an option to edit a copy with Lightroom adjustments. And our file copy options are here. So we click edit. So it will then render out a file. This is the Castletown railway station that I have been talking about on Twitter to try and currently fix the roof. So it's going to obviously go through the loading process. You can have five files open at once that you're editing with this as well. So just to show that we've actually done something, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click classic black and white. And I'm going to come up here to click apply. So now we've come back to Lightroom. And we can see down here that with the three dots indicating that the preview is updating. Select that image again and we can see we now have our black and white version edited inside of Luminar. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you found the video useful, give it a thumbs up and share it around. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.